It's really hard to aim on horseback. Oh my god. Oh, it's a talus. Son of a bitch. Why? Uh, oh god, I've just dunked the horse in the water. That was not my intent. I'm sorry. I thought you would stop. What the hell is happening, bro? That's really bad. Today's video has been brought to you thanks to the support of the wonderful folks over at Patreon.com, and it is linked in the video description if you would like to join them for as little as $1 per month. Thank you once again to them. In case, hello. In case you are wondering, I have absolutely no idea where my uh, my horse is. But you know what? Hell with it. Idiot. I feel like I'm just setting their weapons on fire for them. What is he doing? Ooh. Too many giant dudes throwing giant rocks. Uh oh. Yeah, no thank you. Okay. Works for me. Okay, your HP pretty high. Won't lie to you. Definitely pretty high. All right, let's put that away. Let's. Uh, what are we gonna do here? You know, bomb arrow. Oh, I had to back it up. Nope. I don't know how hard you hit, and I don't really want to find out. Absolutely clobbered me. You know what? Let's heal up, man. Because like I feel like this dude's about to just. Hello. I feel like this dude's about to clown me. Alright, let's get the, the big old weapon out. Give him one of these. It seems bad. I somehow managed to position myself to not get hit by that. Die, damn you! Oh, he's dead. Alright, that was uh, a whole thing that happened. Traveler's store. Okay, there's weapons everywhere. Sturdy thick stick, it has high durability despite the way it looks. That's because it's sturdy. A charred pepper. Boss Bacoblin Fang, okay. Blue Boss Bacoblin Horn. Here's the attack bell. We like. Another Traveler Sword. Alright, we got a lot of shite, so we're gonna get rid of some shite for a Traveler Sword. I mean, they're not great, but like, they're not awful. Um, I'll get rid of that. I think it's time. It served its purpose. Sort of. Yep. Money? This looks like a money chest. No. Hinox. Oh, Hinox. That's what the other guys are called. Uh, high durability, 17 damage. Good lord almighty. Okay. There we go. Decent horde there, all things considered. And we didn't bloody die. Which, yes, surprises me also. Right, so we've got these which increase our damage by 5. So let's actually do that. Let's drop one of them and fuse it to this crappy air sword. And now it is a much less a crappy air sword. I don't think this actually has anything attached to it either, so I'm guessing I can also do it with that. So drop one of those. Yeah, man. Oh, it's a Captain One Blade. Still with high durability. Nice. Like, I tried to steer, bro! You're the one that ran to the wall, not me! Why are you so stubborn? Stop it! Stop it! Turn around! Bad horse. Alright, you stay there now. Combat training throwing. Interesting. Your other attacks are ineffective here. Ready yourself. Right, okay, so... R1. Select material. Uh, these things, I guess? Let me grab... Let me grab... Whoa! You didn't say you were going to be shooting me as well, you bastard. Good lord, man. Was not ready for that. Okay, so you see what I mean? Like... Okay, so you've got to, like, try throwing... It's kind of janky the way they do it. So you, like, start throwing your weapon, and then select the material. And so then you don't throw your weapon. I don't know, weird. Watch the enemy's movements carefully, then throw the material at them. Oh, see, I've done it wrong. Jank. Jank! <laughs> Jank! Oh, you son of a... There we go. And I know what you're thinking. Oh, I've killed him! 
You could just wait until he stands still. Yeah, but where's the fun there? You've proven your mastery. Now proceed to the innermost chamber. Not before I loot your corpse, buddy. Ooh, we get his bow as well. And a Zonite sword. It resonates with attached Zonite devices to slightly increase his attack power. Uh-huh. How do I have no space for any of this? This one's almost broken. Goodbye. The sword ain't great, but I think everything else we have is better, so goodbye. Lutations! Is that the whole shrine? One flower times three. Nice. That's actually pretty sweet. Yeah, that does appear to be the whole shrine. So my reward! Oh no, hang on. We should also get one of the um, HP slash stamina upgrade orby things, right? Okay, cool. I mean, that's the main thing. And you know what the bomb flowers? That's a nice bonus. I will take that. So I will say, the new powers are really cool. But it is a shame, in my opinion. Oh, look. A ton more horses. Horse friends. It is a shame, in my opinion, actually, that they've taken the old powers out. Because there'd be even more variation if you kept those as well. Hey, look. So I'm playing Tears of the Kingdom. Hello, Neo Zexus, if you watch this. Hello. I'm going to murder these guys. It's really hard to aim on horseback. Oh my god. Oh, it's a talus. Son of a bitch. Why? What a shot, bro. What a freaking shot. You know what? We just got bomb flowers. Don't start nothing. Don't be nothing. Shot. Ain't mad about it. You should be there. Pum, pum, pum. Now remember, you gotta launch that arm at me. Oh no, he's not. <laughs> Bitch, the ball! Alright, let's see if we can one shot this one instead of dying a ludicrous amount of times like we did uh, previously. Also, I am, yes, indeed, going to use this. We ain't here to fuck around. Woo. Spooky. I actually don't think that would hit me. But I'm glad we didn't have to find out. What a shot. He's a man, not a god. Hello? All right, I think, I think it's going to be like one hit from death I, when it kicks me off. I genuinely do. And if it is, we're just going to bow it. He's done it. Oh, my God. That launched me so friggin' far. Oh, it opens that. Huh. I did spot that in the distance. We will loot you in a moment. There is stuff absolutely everywhere from all the bokoblins and... Like, there's like a ruby down there, just chunks flying off of him. Oh, speaking of which, it's interesting you have to make the decision then and there. Like, you can't put this in your inventory, like, you can't look at other stuff. I mean, it makes sense. It's absolutely gigantic. Um, yes. You have made the decision for me. Nice. Look at that. It's even more powerful. World's well, deadliest rake. Don't know where my horse went, but, you know, nothing new there. That person on the road over there. Hello, please move. Or is that a horse? I still can't tell. I still can't tell. What am I looking at? Alright. Yep, that's a person. Miss Misko's treasure. You have a mushroom-shaped hat on with pictures of mushrooms on it. In fact, everything you're wearing looks... Okay. Hello there. I hope your travels are treating you well. So I take it... If you've struck up a conversation with a fashion-forward type like me all the way out here, you must also be searching for pieces of a Misko's treasure. What's that? Mm -hmm. Oh, you don't know? There was once a legendary bandit by the name of Misko. I feel like I'm saying that name, name wrong. Misko? Uh, but thievery isn't what made them a legend. It was their unparalleled fashion sense. It said that Misko collected rare outfits from all over the world and hid their pieces throughout Hyrule. <laughs> It may only be a story, but who could resist the call of garments like that? For fashion lovers like me, Misko's treasure is the ultimate score. That's why we're out in force trying to find it. So fate and fashion must have brought the two of us together right here. Shall I tell you where pieces of the treasure are? Yes. I thought that might strike your fashionable fancy. Now, do you have a map? I do. 
And you're just going to tell me? Why? Why would you do this? A piece of fairly wild outfit from Misko's collection said to fill the wearer with power is around here. Really, really close to me, apparently. A piece from the quite stylish outfit uh, said to let you quickly climb cliffs might be here. A piece from a very snappy outfit from Misko's collection said to keep you safe in lightning is around here. All these details come from my various fashion forward friends who travel in other regions, but I'm not sure any of these treasures are quite right for me. Given I don't like to battle, I don't climb cliffs. If you're attempting a difficult journey, I'm sure such styles could come in handy. Uh. That reminds me, do you know about the Great Fairies? What do you mean? Mm. The Great Fairies of Long is ex existed throughout Hyrule and have been known to bless clothing. That's right, they do, don't they? I forgot about that. But since so much ugliness came from <laughs> to our land, I've heard that they've withdrawn from Vir from view. Though I think one of them was seen near Woodland Stable in the northeast recently. Isn't the Woodland Stable, like, in Breath of the Wild? I feel like I remember the name. What's that about, I wonder? Oh, sorry. I've gone on and on. I've, it's been a while since I've been able to talk fashion with anyone. Time for me to get back to searching for Misko's legendary outfits. Good luck and goodbye. And yet you've just created a rival, because you are a fool. An absolute fool. Right, hang on. Let's look at the map. Um, One of them seems to be in that cave right there. Oh, look, there's a, a wizard. Uh, oh, God, I've just dunked the horse in the water. That was not my intent. I'm sorry. I thought you would stop. Is the horse going to be okay? I genuinely didn't mean to do that. I'm coming. Daddy's coming. Fish. Mine. Yum. I think the horse is okay. Itch. 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 That's right, run away! And by run, I mean fly. What the heck? Ah, Bone Man! Can I remember Bone Man? You must kill the skull. It's like a zombie in The Walking Dead. Sturdy long stick. It has high durability. Hmm. What do we have that has crap durability? Breaks quickly. Uh, yeah, but it's like nine damage. I really should just use that and get rid of it. Sorry. Look, sorry. I didn't mean, I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Love me. Hello there. Okay, this is not going to be... Oh, what a shot. I am so good at video games, it's ridiculous. You didn't drop your weapon. I feel rather robbed. Oh, there goes my bow. Uh, let's use this, like I said. We'll change the bow. Let's also heal. We need to start cooking up some food that will actually heal us. The wasting stuff. Man, you are tanky as hell, brother. Shame on me. You got real creepy faces, bro. I've whiffed. A bat, huh? A burning bat. Oh my god. Oh my god. Temperature is getting very high. Yeah, I can see that. What the hell is happening, bro? That's really bad. That is, like, not good. How is he still doing this? Is there, like, something in the sky I can shoot down? Like Lucy with diamonds? No, it doesn't look like it. Yeah, it feels like they've souped up the whiz robes. I remember them being, like, kind of pushovers in the last game. Oh, son of a... Come on! Ugh. I was going to say, surely it's going to stop. Ruby sword. That's a sword? Oh. Oh! Okay, so in Breath of the Wild, they had, like, wands. Like, and this would be, like, a fire wand, right? But, like, it seems like if you just stick a ruby on the end of a, a sword, it becomes a fire wand. Which means the opal being water would become a water wand, right? Interesting. I don't have space for it. And it's probably worth quite a bit. 
Uh, I'll get rid of this. It's it's not great. We'll take that. Ah, here we go. Oh, it's a like like. A different like like. Holy shit! A deadly like like. I don't know health for this shit, bro. Um, I need a cooking pot. We have portable cooking pots. Okay, hold on. I'm just gonna cook outside this like like layer, you know. Oh, it lights itself and everything. Slick. Right, let's cook some stuff up. Because I'm dying and it's really annoying. You can't cook whilst enemies are nearby. Son of a fucking... Alright, two bits of bird. That's a full heal right there, baby. That's good to know. What? They're a one-time use? you got to be kidding. No. Surely they're on a timer. Hold on. It lasts for cooking one recipe only. Ah. No, they are one-time use. Okay, so they're like for emergencies. Like, like, for emergencies, if you will. Alright, um, why is there, like, a ruby over here? What, what is this? Fire key cyber. Huh. Okay. Where, where was there a fire key? Oh, I guess it was from the fire keys that he spawned. The only one I remember. Alright, how are we gonna deal with this? Um, rewind time. Or whatever you call it. Power, the power. Okay, he spits real quick. Okay, so it does it in threes. And we... Is that not your weak point right there? No. Can I avoid the first two and rewind the third one, maybe? Ah! I've broken its shell. And it still do that, I wonder. Shit. Good god, man. I don't know what happened with my re I old man reflexed, and I was just like, damn, I should probably hit that. There we go. Oh, come on. Why is it facing that way? It's fine. We want this to break. We need space. We need weapon space for good weapons. I will burn thee. Never mind. No, I won't, because I'm shit. Why wouldn't you just aim the whole time? There you go. Oh, wow. It's pretty effective, bro. Let's run out of firepower. How does that work? I don't know. Will it recharge over time, maybe? Oh, it seems like it does. Okay. Slain. Almost. Slain. Give me my booty. That's a cool enemy, dude. I like that. I like like that. I, li I like that. I, I'm not trying to make puns here with like. I enjoy that there was a variant of it already. We've seen like the the shielded one with the rocky thing going on. I'm also quite proud of myself that I figured out how to do that. I'm sure there's other ways of doing it, but whatever. A shield once used by the guards of Hyrule Castle. It's easy to handle, but its core is made of wood, so it can catch fire. That's a pretty damn good shield, actually. And we should attach something to it. What are we going to attach to it? I don't know. This horse is a real asshole. Like, he does not go anywhere near where I'm trying to aim him. He's actually a dick. Like, I have to know. Can you put a boulder on your shield? Like, I, I feel like you can. Yeah. Why not? Boulder shield. Boulder shield. Does whatever a boulder shield does. Why is there so many rocks here? This is a strange land indeed. There's one boulder as well. Is there something under the boulder? No. I think I dumped the horse off the cliff again. Keep doing that. Well, so I'm lost. This is not where I was, like, aiming to go. Yep, now the horse is, is, like, real stuck. He doesn't want to go anywhere. Oh. And that coming, didn't you? Oh, look, I found, like, a village or something. Why not? Let's go that way. I Please turn! Oh my god! This horse is so stubborn! Good lord almighty, it's a little talus. All right now, brother. Okay, everybody is attacking me. Leave me alone. I'm trying to get lootations. 
You're one of those bird demon. Yep, yeah, bird demon. He's, he's using the carrying a barrel. I have n oh no. Uh oh. I'm trying to equip a bow. Oh god, why so much damage? Holy crap. Let me go, let me go, let me go. Where'd he go? Why do we not have a bow equipped? What the hell happened? Um, oh god. Oh god, everything's happening. Oh god, every everything is happening. What the, like... Bruh, I don't have a decent weapon to take you- never mind, yes I do. Little bastard. I'm- I'm genuinely upset I keep whiffing. Okay, problem solved. As for you... Suck it. Good lord, man. Right, we will... Endeavor to read these item descriptions later. There's too many item descriptions right now. I want that... I, I want all of this. I think this is from the Octorok. I think it's the green thing. An eyeball. Homing quality, okay. I'm sensing a theme here. That's a creepy looking eyeball, bro. Aerocuda. Come on and do da. Do da Aerocuda. Were Aerocudas in Breath of the Wild? I really don't remember. I don't think they were. Anyway, we saw... Yeah, there's a chest over there. How are we going to get that? No, I won't lie to you. We have not fared well with boats. This is not lost upon me. What I will say, though, is I feel like if we don't piss around with fans, there should be no reason this boat doesn't work. He says, noticing the boat uh, is not working. Okay, so it's like top heavy. Can I not... Does that not even it out a bit? Let's just try this and see if it works. So we need we need a fan. Annoyingly, I think we're going to... Well, we've got a space for a weapon. Let me see if I can find like a stick or something. Well, in that case, I guess we're going to have to destroy one of these. So we've got a stick. So then we go in the menu. We drop one of those. We fuse it. And now we should be able to sail the boat. The boat is still front heavy. I mean, I guess the, I mean, the logical solution to that is remove this and put it more in the middle. This is the world's shittest boat. Like, I'm going actively away from where I'm trying to get to. I'm going to level with you. After I'm done recording here, I'm looking up a freaking tutorial on building boats and stuff. Because, like, apparently, I don't get it. Yeah, okay, so you can ultra hand it from the edge here, not the other edge. Bomb flowers! We'll take those. Now, I did want to get my horse across. That could well be a stable we saw over there, so I've got to swim back. Son of a bitch. He's done it. He's the greatest swimmer that ever lived. You don't look all that friendly. Oh, fight me, horse. Go over the rocks. Oh my god. Like, it's the exact opposite of a Skyrim horse, which will go anywhere. This thing will go nowhere. It's so freaking stubborn. You gotta admit, I almost had him. Was I really low on health? Or did he just hit really hard? I... Uh, uh. Revenge thy name be No, I, w I he just hit really hard. Okay, cool. Bitch. I think he will drown. Um, maybe if he landed in the water, yeah, but he didn't. Whoa! Eat it. Whoa, I'm crouching? Could not do a backflip whilst crouching. Good to know. Oh. Yo, look at these abs, man. This dude's shredded. Come on, bro. I'm going for it. Worth it. Eight damage. So it consumes less stamina during charge attacks because it's lightweight. Hmm. Thank you. Right, we want that. Oh, we, we actually have it. I forgot we had space. What are you doing? Like, what are you doing? You absolute lemon. Stop that right now. 
Oh, that's embarrassing. Oh, come on, man! Now, in hindsight, getting his shit out of the water is going to be quite annoying. Sturdy wooden stick. Blue Bacoblin Horn. Yep, yep, this is, uh, uh Jank. Alright, musket stamina back. We'll grab these. I do not know where his weapon went. Hopefully the weapon ain't even in the water. If not, super useful. 13 attack power. Holy crap, bro. It's just a horn from like what is essentially a pretty riffraff enemy. Where is his, his badass sword? Hello? Um, where'd it go? Did it sink? Well, that is most unfortunate, let me tell you. At least we got the, the weapon from the, the Bokoblin, but yeah. Uh, not the one I was looking for. Okay, so there is a bridge over there, but it's miles away. And we're on rocky ground and the horse does not like it. Is that a giant skull? Ooh, look at that. Yeah, I did, you little bitch. You suck at hide and seek. What the heck is going on over here? Is that a man fighting up a goblin? Mm, appears so, yes. Don't worry, friend, I will save you! Hello. Drive by, son. Don't worry, I got your ass. Spin the wind. Yeah, you wanna back up, buddy. I'm like a lion when it's eating, I'm dangerous. I do not want your stick. I want your shield, though. In defense. Hello. Reward me. Oh. Savre. Hello there. Are you a traveler too? My name is Savre. I'm a wandering chef. I wander from place to place searching case for unique, delicious ingredients. You both seem to be like mind explorers. You're welcome to use my cooking pot whenever you like. Oh. oh, and I bet the things I've learned in my cave searches could come in handy on your journey. Mind if I share? Caves are chock full of valuable ores and ingredients. They're like nature's treasure chests. If you're not savvy to the joys of a good cave, you're not traveling to the fullest. Mm. Princess are there's an opening in the ground north of here that leads into a cave. If you break into the Break one of the ore deposits in there with a the hammer. You get the ore, obviously. But other than that, there's flint for sight fires. Yeah, all right. We know. Oh. We know how it works. You've taught me nothing. Where's my horse? I don't know. Oh, my God. It's miles away. The hell? Dazzle fruit. A fruit charged with powerful light. Break it to unleash dazzling sparks that blind any monsters nearby. Maybe I wasn't supposed to hit that. But I did. Why, yes, I do see that chest there. Can we... There's a dead fish. Never mind. It's a dead bird. Uh, can we grab it from here? No. Annoying. Where... Where would you get that from? I guess maybe, like, the shoreline over there. That shoreline's pretty well protected. I don't feel like dicking around with that right now. There's probably nothing major in the chest, so I'm not gonna worry about it at the moment. Hello. Who are you? He appears to have a quest. Alright, well, we have essentially arrived. Or at least close enough, because it's just over there. At that settlement that we saw. So, uh, yeah! Next time, we will talk to these people, check, check out the quest, check out the cave, find out what's going on here, etc. Also, I think we're pretty close... Mm, no, we're freaking miles away, but we are pretty close to... This. The piece of the powerful outfit, which I think might be in the cave. Anyway, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, please do like, comment, subscribe, all that jazz. Thank you so much for the support of the series. Thank you so much to this month's patrons. Patreon.com slash Mr. Antonel. Please link to the video description if you would like to join them. Genuinely could not do this without the support of the patrons. Their names this month are... Anarchy C, CJM, The Propagator, Sakanzi, Colby Ruth Holden, Draconis2987, Zadnama, Iceclave, Brett D, Alex, Manuel Satula Garcia, Alex Lee, Not a Porpoise, King Steel, that EV, Raptor Zero, Falcon5982, Fibkin, Trimagnus, Malcolm Davis, Aaron Bridges, Darth Hamos, Conrad82, Lime, Green, Daggy, Israfel, Meep Sheep, I Am Scarecrow666, Edith W, Justin Alexander, Darkstar0915, Nickerin, Trent123, Bloodpire, Rexburum, Awena1997, Luna Parker, Blackwolf8994, Miss Justice 83, Shadow Sephiroth 666, Billy Nine, KP Shadow Squirrel, Loot Smoke Soldier, Jonathan Eriks, Philip Rep, and Hitbox. Thank you so much, everyone, and I'll see you next time.